Yo, what's going on YouTube? It's your boy D. Lloyd. So, game three of the NBA Finals just concluded with the Cleveland Cavaliers defeating the Golden State Warriors 96-91 in a crazy game that had a lot of ups and downs, especially because the Cleveland Cavaliers came out dominating the game and they punked the Golden State Warriors. I mean, just the whole game, Bogut looked terrible in my opinion he wasn't coming up to help when lebron james was coming into the lane and harrison barnes he cannot i would not start him in moving forward um i know that you know they like to give him they like to start him they like to bring in andre iguodala later but harrison barnes looked flat out terrible he scored zero points on zero for eight shooting three turnovers only three rebounds, two fouls. The man really didn't do anything productive. He played 19 minutes, but Andre Iguodala is clearly the the hardest working player on that team. I mean, he was clearly guarding LeBron James all night when he came in. He ended up playing 36 minutes, which is great for Andre Iguodala, and that is great for the Warriors. In the first half, he was pretty much the only thing that the Warriors had going for them. But something really needs to change in that whole mentality. I do feel that... The Warriors, towards the end, they played great again, almost like they did in Game 2 when they came on strong late. They closed the 20-point gap. And eventually, I think at one point it was a one-point game or a three-point game. They got her really close, but they just cannot give up those early leads. They only scored 37 points in the first half, so they need to re rework something in their offense. All these threes they're shooting are clearly not benefiting them a lot. I know they're trying to live or die by the three, but clearly at this point they're just dying by the three. It's not working, and they are a team that had a lot of ball movement throughout the playoffs and the regular season, and a lot of that is has stopped in this series. You don't see as much ball movement from the Golden State Warriors. You just pretty much see them coming down, shooting up a three, going back on defense, coming back down, shooting up another three, and they really need to get back to moving the ball. LeBron James, on the other hand, he had another great game, 40 points once again. I'm not sure how long he can keep this up, but as long as they refuse to double-team LeBron, I'm sure he's going to go ahead and he's going to shoot at least 30 times every single game. At some points, it feels like he should get the rest of his teammates involved a little bit more, but he's been playing fantastic across the board. I mean, LeBron James, like I said, he's a freak of nature, and he is going to win his team some games. I still, however think that the Golden State Warriors will win this series. That has not changed. For whatever reason, I just feel that the Warriors are going to get these things together. I think they will give David Lee some more minutes, and David Lee played fantastic when he came to the game. I believe he only played about 14 or 15 minutes, but he had 11 points. He got a lot of rebounds, set solid screens, and he actually came into the paint and helped out when LeBron James drove in. So David Lee's going to get some more minutes. At least he should get some more minutes for the Warriors. And like I said, Andre Iguodala, he needs to continue to play in 30 plus minutes a game and Harrison Barnes needs to play underneath 20 he just not he just doesn't have what it takes to guard LeBron I thought he'll be able to guard him a little bit better and match up with him more but clearly Andre Iguodala is who they need to have on LeBron James but those are my thoughts on game three like I said I think the Warriors are still going to win this and I think the Warriors will actually upset the Cavaliers and win game four on Thursday but I want to know what you guys think about this whole series and what you guys think about game three let me know in the comment section below it's your boy d lord i'm gonna see y'all next time peace